All right, you guys, so I'm going to show you how to broadcast uh, using Virtual DJ 8. It's actually a pretty simple process if you know how to uh, work well with it. Um, Virtual DJ 8 just got released last week, and it's basically just for uh, people who bought the license. Uh, so if you have the license, you'll be able to download it uh, for free on the website once you log in. Uh, basically, you want to hit configuration up there, the settings. Uh, all your settings will basically pop up. You have your audio, your interface, controllers, options. You want to go down to broadcast, okay? Now, I'm going to stop broadcasting here just so, so I can show you guys. What you want to do is you want to, in order to broadcast on a radio, you want to click on radio server, okay? You want to go down and you want to uh, configure, first of all. Under configure, you're gonna put your radio station names. Mine's is Live Pure D EDM DJs. Uh, that's the radio station that I'm I'm DJing for. Under protocol, you want to you know you, you want to use Shoutcast or Icecast, one of them. Uh, encoding quality 96, uh, just so I can get a longer band bandwidth. Uh, server URL, that's where you want to put your IP. Uh, Ours is 66, 55, 88, 65, so I just put that. Server port, you want to put in what, you know, what server port your radio station gives you. So that's what you want. And then the password, whatever password they have set up, that's what you want. Uh, the session name, uh, I just put in DJ Sirius, Live Period DM DJs. So if you, you know, whatever radio station name or whatever your DJ name is that's what you want to put in and then your session gen genre uh, you want to put in whatever you spin if it's open format put open format whatever you want to put once you're done with that you want to click in start broadcast it'll say broadcasting right away if it works and, it, and you put in all the right information and it'll say broadcasting on you know whatever radio station it is and then your total time would be down there so the nice thing about it is that it also shows your current your current uh, song as well um, and basically you can you know play your EDM mix or whatever mix you want and uh, on the broadcasting when you go to configure it'll actually show the song name, the current song that it shows on the, uh, it'll show up on the, on the radio. So once I log, log in to tune in, which is what we use, uh, under the song name, it'll show the song name. So that's basically it. It's pretty simple. Virtual DJ 8 is what I use. It works perfect. Haven't had any issues with it yet. I've been doing it for about an hour now. So that's it. DJ Serious out.